Hey people, this is Gaf and today I'm in Chiang Mai on a mission finding the best, I'm telling you the best, cow soy in the whole Chiang Mai. I'm gonna go to five different places, five different street vendors and try their own cow soy in one full day. I'm gonna be so full, I'm gonna be so happy at the end. And without further ado, let's go to the first location. Woo! So for my first location, I went to Khao Soy Mai Sai and it was really, really good. The noodles were so fresh, even the fried ones. It was super quick to make and the soup was so flavory. The chicken was also really tender and I think it was a really, really fucking good start for this thing. Really, really good. Soup is so good. This first one was an amazing start. I think it was the best cow soy I had already in two months. Here we are. So the second place I went to was cow soy kunyai. It was alright, it was not the best. The noodles were not super fresh. The soup was okay. Nothing amazing I would say. They had very small portion and it took so long for them to prepare it. I remember I waited there for probably like half an hour. One great thing about this uh, was that the chicken was divided into small pieces, which was quite nice. So there was not a chicken leg, but at the same time it was not as tasty as a chicken leg. So mm. it was not the best. The noodles didn't seem to be fresh. Uh, even the fried ones were thin. The soup was good, uh, but not. I don't know the other one. I thought I just wanted to have more and more and more. This one was uh, okay. The third place I went to was Khao Soy Arak and uh, it was very local, not many tourists at all, it was a very small place, it was only 30 baht uh, for the Khao Soy and that soup had something different, it was really tasty but it didn't, it didn't taste like the others, it had something particular. I don't know how to describe it but I guess the best thing for you would be just to try. The noodles were so fresh and even the chicken was so tender and flavory. The only thing I can say badly about this place was just the portion were quite small. Now this guy, <laughs> I love these people. I really love these people, for fuck's sake, except the mosquitoes. <laughs> but 30 baht, 3 zero, like one dollar, and it was fucking pretty good. No tourists, just Thai people in the middle of the whole town. Oh, maybe this is my favorite one. Maybe this is my favorite one. So good. I still feel alright, I don't feel sick, so let's get to the place number four and try it out. So the fourth place I went to was Khao Soy Bulai and everything was great. The presentation was really good, the plate looked amazing and the noodles were fresh, the chicken was tender, the soup was fantastic, fantastic, very nice place. The only thing I would say that was not the best were the the side, you know, the onions and the pink holes, they could have been better, they were not the best, but except for that, very, very, very good. Whew. I guess uh, I'm feeling uh, quite full, but I still have one left to try. Gosh, I think. The fifth and last place I went to was Khao Soy Lung Prakit Kat Gorm. The soup was really good, the chicken was tender and flavory. The noodles were okay. I didn't particularly like the noodles, I think it's just a personal opinion. The fried ones, they tasted like pretzels. And the noodles were fresh, but I, I prefer other places. But except for that, everything was really, really nice. And yeah, I bet the chicken uh, was fresh. <laughs> So, which one for me was the best? It's hard to pick. I wouldn't pick the second one because uh, it was not the best. It was uh, actually the worst one. I would not recommend anybody to go to that one. And all the other fours are really, really good and I think everybody should try. And then it's probably like a subjective thing to understand which one you would like the most. But for me, the best one was the third one. Cow Soy Arak. Oh, the look. It was so local, it was so small. The soup was so good. Fantastic. Oh my gosh. Anyway, it was a pleasure. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was useful for you. And I'll see you in the next one. Ah.